Hey everyone, Luke here from Bedford Camera and Video, and I've got two cameras here that will really help step up your production game. We've got the NX80 as well as the Z90 from Sony, both of which are great cameras for all around use. Both of these cameras are very similar in the fact that they each have a one inch CMOS sensor, they have phase detect autofocus, as well as a 12 times optical zoom from Zeiss. They do have an 18 times clear image zoom, as well as a 2.8 to f4 variable aperture lens. With both of these cameras, you have a fully automatic mode that you can utilize to shoot in, or you can dial in all of your settings with the full manual capabilities of each of these cameras. Another helpful feature that both of these cameras possess is face detection. So it allows you to have a more accurate autofocus system when you're trying to record yourself or someone else. In addition, both of these cameras feature a top handle. It is removable if you don't want it, but for those of you that want to put it on, it allows you to have two XLR inputs with dedicated controls for each one, as well as stop, start, and zoom functionality from the top of this handle. And for those of you that are trying to utilize the external audio recorders, something like a sound mixing board, this will allow you to interject that audio directly from your board into the camera feed itself. Both of these sensors allow you to shoot 4K up to 30 frames a second and 1080 up to 120 frames a second. And with the included battery, it allows you to shoot approximately 140 minutes. Now, when it comes to storing all of that media, each of these camera features a dual SD card slot, which you can utilize in both overflow or redundancy. Now, what those mean, is when you have the camera set to redundant, it records the same exact footage two times, one on each SD card slot. Now, when you have overflow, it allows you to record all the way to the end of one card and then transfers over directly to the next card to fill it up. So there is one main difference between each of these cameras. With the NX80, you have an HDMI out only. On the Z90, you have an HDMI as well as an SDI out. Why is that important for your type of production? Well, an HDMI out only allows you to transmit a feed up to about 50 feet worth of cable. Now, you can get a powered HDMI cable or an optical cable that will push that feed further, or you can get powered adapters which will allow you to transmit that feed across a longer HDMI cable. With an SDI out, a standard SDI cable will allow you to transmit that feed up to about 300 feet without any additional hardware. In addition, the SDI cable has a locking BNC connection that keeps that cable from pulling out when you don't want it. And a unique function about these video cameras compared to others is the fact that both of these cameras have the ability to live stream to Facebook or to YouTube with a single camera setup. And there you have it. That's the Sony NX80 and Z90. If you want to add these to your production, go ahead and visit us online at bedfords.com. If you found this video helpful, go ahead and hit like and subscribe to our page. I'm Luke from Bedford Camera and Video, and we'll catch you next time.